Hey everybody, a little bit of a different video here. This was one of the very first etudes that I learned when I went to university to study college. And I remember just painstakingly going through this uh, for rhythmic accuracy. And it was absolutely uh, hell, uh, to be honest. And I can't believe it took me that long to learn this piece. What we have here is a melody written for the thumb with an extra little like uh, open string thing. For the most part, it's just open strings. Idea that surrounds this melody. Uh, the purpose behind this etude is to get you to separate a melody from what is surrounding it and to give your thumb uh, something to do, a little melody to play, because that is not something that we get to do often. If you're interested in learning this piece, I highly suggest putting the metronome very, very slow and clicking out the eighth notes because most of this piece is all eighth notes and uh, really working out the rhythmic accuracy between the thumb and what is going on in your top hand, setting the metronome maybe to 60 or even slower. And once you get the rhythm all down, then really work on making sure that the thumb is really heavy throughout the entire piece to really bring out this melody. And finally, adding dynamics and articulations. It's a really great piece for a beginner. If you're an intermediate or advanced player, you could go back and relearn this piece and add in all the dynamics and articulations that Brower has written out for us and bring it to a work of art instead of just an exercise. I'm considering doing more of these etudes uh, where I have a little talk back at the end of the video like this for some light educational content. If you liked it, please let me know in the comments below. If you thought it was dumb and redundant and too simple, then let me know that as well. Hopefully, as I do more of these and we get into more complex etudes, they will be more interesting for more people. As always, please like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the little bell icon so you can stay in touch with all of the content that I do on this channel, and we will see you in the next one.